You're talking. Yeah, we're out here at uh, old Hicktown Slaughterhouses. We've been running them out here since 1923. Been doing it the same way every day. Uh, Just chainsaw, a rope, and a billy club. We're gonna show. We're gonna show you guys how you uh, process a cow. You're right, we got to sneak up on them, they're pretty wily. Right. This, is, this is how we get the cows once we get them broke. chainsaw out. This is how we've uh, been doing it this way for at least 100 years. This here chainsaw out. This is how we take off their legs. Hey, I'm Harry, and I'm here with the um, Humane Society, and this is Johnny here with Western Slaughter Company. We're going to show you how to humanely slaughter beef. Hold the gun. No reaction? He's dead. Quick, clean, and very efficient, and absolutely painless. The first way we killed our cow was not the proper way. It may have been the way it was done many years ago, but in this day and age, we don't do it that way. The way it was done years ago was done by people who had no connection, no feeling, no real sense of what part of society they really were being a part of. In today's society, people that live off the land very deeply respect and care for the land and what comes off of it and would never treat their cattle the way we treated our cows to show you how it used to be done. The second way is how it's done today, and it is the most main way of slaughter that we've been able to come up with in this day and age. Many uh, strict laws and regulations are, were put in place by the USDA to make sure that these slaughterhouses ran very tight ships and had very the specific procedures on how animals were to be slaughtered and processed. Special thanks to our full-time cow, Kay Gill. And that's the way the cookie crumbles. <laughs>